Oh my god, look at this. Look at this. All right, everyone, welcome back to another Black Ops 3 Custom Zone maps. And today, I know I'm doing the second video of zombies in a row, but this map I've got to show you guys. This is the Bus T-Bot Survival Open Beta. Now, this map I've been waiting for so long to come out, and I can't believe someone's actually done the remaster. It, it's so good. I love the remaster series when it came to the diner, the, you know, the farmhouse, the town, and now finally someone's done the depot. Now, just to tell you guys, this is just the depot. This isn't like, say, the transit map, but this is the start of where transit would be. And I'm here to show you guys exactly what this um, this map entails so far. So far, I'm already loving it. I know there's some extra places we can actually go, though. So it looks like I'm stuck inside here. Is that mystery box light purple? It is. But look at it, people. Look at it. Look how cool it looks. I'm already so happy with it. Let's get the gobbledy gun that cost me 500. Tone death? All oh, the actors and killing zombies. Silly sounds will play when zombies are killed. <laughs> oh, I'm loving the sound already. So I've got Olympia. Oh, is that not Olympia? No, it's not Olympia. 725? Uh oh. Zombies are coming faster now. Hopefully I don't get overrun. The zombies seem to be already pretty fast. Stop playing funny noises. As long as I get to an open area, I'm happy. Oh, okay. I might have to scoozy my way around this map just to survive. Let's start by just opening the doors, give me a clear outside, and let's have a look at the map, people. So this this video right here is a showcase of the map. I'm not going to go in depth of it. There's no Easter eggs or anything just yet. It's just to explore the map and actually, you know, help the person who created this map to give him some ideas of what he can improve on. So let's have a look. If any of you guys spot any glitches along with me in my video, please put a comment down below or actually check out the, you know, the homepage and Steam Workshop where the guy actually made the map. Give him some ideas. Because so far, I reckon this guy is on the right track and he's doing a fantastic job. This map is huge. You can go down that way? This, so it's more than just the bus depot. Because what? In transit, you can only go in this little area in the center here. And there's a little round area over there. There was lava on the ground last time though. So it seems like the rain's actually cleared some stuff up. You can go out there too. That's nuts. Anywhere else you can go? Oh, there seems to be some debris over here. So you can go inside the garage here, which there seems to be a workbench over there. Is there zombies? Yeah, there's zombies. Come here, zombies. Oh my god. And you gave me instant kill. That's 1,000 for that. So I'm surprised that these uh, guns cost 1,000. Do I still get money? Yeah, I do. So there's no jingles when it comes to perks here, I'm pretty sure. I'm not sure if there's a perk limit too. It would be really cool if there was a perk limit. I reckon if the... By the looks of it, I think they just have the original perks on the map. So basically just four of them. Maybe five, actually. Stamina up might be on there too. First thing we need to do is actually get a gun because I don't see how to survive in this anytime soon. But to be honest, a thousand for a gun? Oh. You can go in here too. Hi. How are you? Ah, uh, because I got no ammo. It's going to take a while to actually reset the animation. The knife in. Well, how much is this one? 1,600. Kill you. I'll go past these guys. Go inside and grab that gun on the wall. So I actually have something to shoot these guys with. Ah, yes. The DMR. Oh. This gun sounds so good. I'm loving that sound. However, it's not so strong. For round three for this gun to actually be this weak, it seems to be a bit... I don't know. What do you, what do you guys think? You reckon it's a bit weak? I think it's a bit weak. That's what we're going to do is go around and find the shield parts. They're going to be around here somewhere. The only thing I want to do is open up all doors and explore every aspect of this map. Get all perks and, you know, get all the parts for the shield. 
Do you know what would be really cool if it was actually the electric fan? <laughs> 1,250 going there. So if I'm going to survive this, I need to find out where Jug is. Oh, there's Mule Kick, actually. Mule Kick's over there. Oh, my God. These silly sounds. When are they going to stop? Thank you. They stopped. Oh my god. Oh! The minigun! Oh, it's known as the death machine! Oh! This map has such excellent sound quality. That is so realistic! Where are you, zombies? Yeah, you're beautiful. Where's the next one? Where are you? They seem to be a lot faster at the start. Or is that just me? Well, I don't know anymore. So let's go through here in the dumpster area back here. Oh, that opens to the breeze there too. There's a jukebox there. There is the Gallows SA-12. Perfect. Oh, hello. Oh, that opens up this entire section at the back here. So I can go straight for a double tap, but it is raining, people. It is raining. It is a uh, very slow movement. You must turn on power first. So there is power. I just have to find it. Okay. First of all, let me get mystery box because this weapon absolutely is shit. I'm not sure how I feel about the purple though. I like the blue. What was that sound? Why did it just seem like something crazy just spawned? Oh, this V collar. Okay, I'm going into the open area. They spawn right behind you first. So I found speed collar in the back there. My god, these weapons are so weak. This guy actually made the weapon seem so. Oh my god, double points. Do you guys see that? It actually does the animation just for actually getting like double points, like a jackpot every time you get a kill. How sick is that? That's a cool jackpot. Wait, I already opened this up? So it opened up this entire side. Now I'm not sure how I feel about that actually. Just open up all of them at once. You should have done them um, individually, I reckon. But let's go inside here to see if there's anything in here. Ooh. Oh, interesting. There's something I did here by accident. I'm not sure it said tidy up or something, but if someone knows what it is, please down tell me because I couldn't see because of the, uh, the double points that, were, that was in the way. I'm going to get this weapon off the wall. The ammo off it is not very good though. Let's go through this way. This area I haven't been through yet. And it's all water though. Let's uh... I'm gonna kill some zombies to actually, you know, be able to get through that without dying. So, so far, we found um, Mule Kick, Double Tap, Speed Collar, and of course, um, Instant Revive. Self Revive. <laughs> you can go down in the basement! You can go down in the basement! How cool is that? Oh, I reckon Jug's down there, actually. Ow, that that this I just hurt. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. They're coming out of nowhere, people. So we explore back there. I still need to find out where power is. I reckon power has something to do with downstairs. Damn it. We quickly need to find power, so let's clear the breeze down here. There's power. Aha! There's Jug. Oh, let me go upstairs. There seems to be a lot of them. 
Next thing I want to grab is double tap. Aha, so I can just constantly just do 33% more damage. Is that actually what it does? Let's go through here quickly and we're out in the open. Good. I do like how it does give you a clear description of what the perk actually does. It's quite nice. I'm not sure. Double tap's not really seem like it's doing much. And I have run out of ammo for that gun. Oh, actually, I do see the difference when it comes to this gun. Carpendo! Ah, oh, I got the minigun. I don't want that. Let's use the mystery box again. Hopefully, I get something really good. Is that the PBSH? Oh, boy. Give me speed collar, and I've gotten four perks. So, there's a... Why does it seem like there's lightning hitting us? Let's see how powerful the PBSH is. Hmm. Oh, okay. That is not as powerful as I thought it would be. Oh, pack of punches over there. Okay. Okay, this gun actually just seems like a point gun in this game. Yeah, this is definitely a point gun. So this is nice. Like to me, I don't classify the PPSH as a strong weapon. I classify it as just something you can use to get a shitload of points very fast. And for this, I've already run out of ammo and it's only one round. So maybe I backtrack what I just said then about the PPSH. Make the PPSH a tiny bit stronger. Just a tiny bit. Now, here's a good example of can I get more than one, like four perks? Yes, I can. So there's no perk limit on this map. And I don't think there's shield parts yet, to be honest. Ah, oh, Wonder Waffle's over there. Radio. Oh, is that double points? Perfect. Now, let's get Mystery Box. Oh, Lord Almighty, is the Ray Gun Mark II? Oh, that was a good find, actually, wasn't it? <laughs> oh, okay. I might have to resort to using... Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh... Was that instant kill? Oh, that the hitbox. Oh, Jesus. I went down. I, I, oh, oh. I got bamboozled very hard just then, people. Press R to ready up. To ready up? Oh. So you don't have to start the next round until you're ready. That's pretty cool. So it's actually giving you a chance to explore the map first before actually starting the next round. So with this, this will be pretty cool. So let's go over to... Ah, uh, pack a punch. Let's see what we can actually get. Clear the breeze, 20,000? It costs 20,000! Alright, people, hold on. I will skip to the part where I actually need I got 20,000 for you guys. But first of all, let's do this. Let's see what else perks we can get. So it seems like you can actually get a shitload of perks on this map. So I'm going to get all the perks for you guys to see what you can actually get. And if I go through here, now everyone watch my points. Watch my points. No, not again. Oh, I almost died. So yeah, this is definitely a point gun, if I've ever seen one. That was very easy. <laughs> 24,000 in one round. 
Oh, that's great. Let's get mystery box again. And that's not something I want. Did I make a crawler? I did make a crawler. That's all right. With the crawlers that I got down there, let's go down here and actually get as many wonder visits as I can. So this might actually take a while, people, but I'll show you every single perk I can get. You may only carry six perks. So you can get a lot of perks in that selection, but you can only have six. Not sure how I feel, but I do love it. That right there, and let's get the PPSH. It was instant powder. Oh. Oh. Hold on. Oh. Oh. I do love it. It actually looks like fire. Look at that. That's sick. That's actually, that's pretty good. I do like the actual effects at the very end. You can actually tell it's different bullets too. All right, everyone. I believe that is all that we're going to show for this map. I love the extensions of the map. And I do love how you can actually go to the basement part down below to turn on power. There's an outside area, which I hopefully it does continue. It'll be really cool if you can actually go out and explore through that tunnel over there too. To like a whole new area. But with that said, everyone, I do hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave a like and comment down below if you guys want to see more videos like this and subscribe to further support the channel. See you next time, guys.